Hey, what's going on? It's Alfred aka Freeze Mogul. And real quick, I, I'd like to take the time right now and show you guys how to use MetaTrader 4 to monitor charts, which is very important. It's all about the charts when it comes to trading. So I'm going to show you how to use this program so you could set up your charts and monitor it multiple at the same time multiple charts at the same time so when you open the program it's gonna look exactly like this so what i have open i have one two three four five six seven eight eight different currency pairs open right now and i could switch to them like this just by, just by the click of a button i could switch to them and monitor them that way but it gets even better you could actually see all eight of them in one screen by clicking this button right here and boom there you go you don't necessarily need this you could close this and there you go you have more room to set up your currency uh, the, the currency charts and uh, if you like to open more all you have to do is click on file actually close a lot of them before so any of them that you if you happen to close any of them you could actually reopen them again by clicking here or you could go to the charts again and um, select the ones that you want uh, let's say I want to add Euro chief so I would right click on it and I would click on chart window and there you go now I'm going to show you real quick how to install the indicators in the chart. All you have to do is click on in insert, indicators, and then go down. All those are indicators that you can use. Those are the popular ones. But I have custom indicators, which I cannot give you because I don't even know where they're at. My laptop is the only computer that I have that has it. So, apologize about that. So the best way, to, if you want to use my indicators, is to trade with me. As you know, I trade 4 o'clock in the morning. And uh, moving on. So you have, what I have, I have the center of gravity. And I have the money, well, sometimes the money flow bars. But uh, I have the error indicator. So as you can see, if I were to add those indicators on this I would click on indicators custom click on error, error indicator click OK there you go I have the error indicators set up and uh, let's say I want to add the center of gravity I'll go to custom again and click on center of gravity boom there you go and uh, another thing if you want to look at different charts as you know they are the one minute chart there are 15 minutes chart there are half an hour chart I'm going to show you how to switch to them right now so you, you can move it around you can set it up any way you want anyway anyhow um, you can zoom in if you want you can zoom in on the chart and uh, it's best to use the candlestick chart instead of this one. So if you want to use candlestick, all you have to do is, is right there. Click on this. Boom. There you go. Candlestick. And uh, let's see. Yeah. So if you want to switch from one minute, this is one minute chart. Five minute chart is loading up. Fifteen minute chart. Half an hour. Hour. Four hour. A day. A week. A month. So you can switch back and forth to them. If you want to maximize the window of course you just click on that and that's pretty much it that's all I do I set up the chart I monitor multiple charts at the same time I see the best one and I jump in and I place my tree that's it folks if you have any questions comment below if you'd like to trade with us mm -hmm. visit my website at secretmoneygroup.com slash forex and um, I have instructionals on, on there how to sign up and uh, just get in contact with me first so that I know and I can uh, help you out and um, I'm more than willing to make you a demo account once you make a deposit and uh, let's start trading
welcome to the team and thanks for watching peace